What is going on guys, it's your boy Prime TV here back with another video and in today's video I'm gonna have something a little different now in today's video I'm gonna be showing you guys some sneakers in the last video you guys really enjoyed it You guys really blew it up, you know, you guys showed a lot of love to it And so today I'm gonna be showing you guys my hoopy shoes now a lot of people ask me You know where I get my hoopy shoes at because I do have a lot of pairs now I'm gonna show I'm gonna go in chronological order from when I got them from From where I'm at now and without further ado, let's get into it And if you guys really do enjoy this video make sure you guys leave a thumbs up and without further ado, let's start off with number one so starting off on the list, I'm gonna show you guys my book bag that I be taking to the gym because you know everybody's got that big ass backpack. This is exactly what I got. I got the same Nike backpack that everybody else got. It's just the USA Camp one, you know, just a simple one like this, you know, nothing crazy. This is just the bag that I be taking everywhere. So that's the bag. Now, number one on my list are I don't even know what Kobe this is, but you guys just just look at this, look at this. I played my heart out in these. I think I, I got these. I went on a little family trip in Vegas and I we went to the Nike outlet and these were literally sitting like look at this other pair like this pair got a whole like look at this got a mouth if you guys do enjoy the video like it up but yeah guys so this is gonna be I don't even know what Kobe this is what is this the 8 the 11 one of those but this is gonna be the number one all right y'all so starting off with my next pair I actually got the Harden, I think these are the volume fives. Now, these are, I mean, one of the lightest sneakers that I've ever played in. I actually got these when I went on a trip to San Francisco. I actually got these at a mall. But, um, yeah, th these are, I mean, I really like bright colors. A lot of people already know that. If you guys have been with me for the channel for a minute now, you guys already know what kind of style I like. And it's just bright colors. Like, what's not to love about these? These are an orange shoe. Like, it's just, it's just crazy. But, uh... I had like two other colors of these. I had the the blue ones and then I had the neon green ones. And I would always mix match with all of them and these were just it was just crazy. But I ended up selling them and but I ended up keeping these ones. These ones I just use outdoors uh, mainly. But um this is number two. Uh, so the next shoe on my list is the Kobe 5 Bruce Lee the alternates. Yeah, those are what they called. So uh I literally played in these only in outdoor. Like I literally beat the bejesus out of them, like they are done for like these are completely like they, these are chalk now like I'm pretty upset but I'm gonna definitely gonna need to get a different pair for these uh, these are like like literally like the entire shape is like completely like crushed like I play like I think these are a complete size and a half bigger than my foot actually so I literally like have to crunch the laces and like the whole shape of the shoe is completely off like it's it's bad and I like, look at all the paint corrections and stuff like that that I had to do I literally tried to save these but this was my, uh, this was an indoor shoe at one point. I loved them, played in them for so long. And then they ended up just turning into some outdoor shoes. So let's get on to the next one. That's the next shoe on this list, is the white Nike Adapt. If you guys know, these are some auto lacing sneakers. I don't know if these, I think these are dead right now, actually. Yeah, they're dead because I literally do not wear these anymore. But this was my first uh, Nike Adapt shoe right here. I actually have uh, another pair. I'm gonna show you guys down the list. But um, these, the only thing I can say about these is that they are extremely heavy. They are extremely heavy. Um, but it's super cool because you know the app and everything like that. There's an app that you can like change the colors and everything like that. And it's just, it's super cool. But um, other than that, you know, traction's great. Uh, only thing I do, do not recommend, only, only con, do not get this pair. Do not get the white pair because it's yellowing like crazy, like really bad. Like I barely played in these and they yellowed and it just looks so ugly now. Like, I think I'm about to turn these into some outdoor shoes if I don't sell them. But next shoe on the list is the white Nike Adapts. All right, y'all, it's time to get into some heat. Made it this far. Thank you so much, but I do want to make an announcement. I am starting a clothing brand. If you guys did want to go check out the Instagram, this is it right here. I'm literally posting it up right now. This is the hoodie. Uh, I'm starting a new clothing brand. It's called Rather Be. And, uh, if you guys want to go uh, support it, it's right there. Thank you so much. Watching. So not too shortly after I got the white adapts, I was just you know completely you know in love with them. But I just didn't like the fact that it was yellowing. I just didn't like that. It just bothered me because it just I like taking pictures when I play basketball, and just the fact that they were yellowing made me upset. So I had to get another pair. So I went out and got the the damn near a bread colorway, guys. Let I me mean, look at this pair. This thing is just so beautiful. I mean, I got the just basically the reds. I think I got this part. I got this pair on Mercari for like 200 bucks. It was crazy. Now they're like. Sitting at like almost like 300 to 400 a pair, but look at guys. I think these ones are charged. Yep, look at this. You can play songs on. The, I'm just playing, but uh, 
Guys, this is literally, I mean, I love this pair to death because I mean, it's just an all black pair. They can't get, they can't get ruined because I mean, you can step on them all you want, but it's a black shoe nonetheless. And then the translucent sole, I love translucent soles. I don't know what about it, but I just love translucent soles. Something about it just, I don't know. But this is the next pair on the list. The Nike Adapt in the black colorway, in the black and red. I'm calling the brands. So for the next shoe on the list, I never actually ended up getting the first, uh, I think he ended up dropping like two colorways before it, but I don't know why, I just didn't like the shoe at first. But then once I saw this colorway, I just needed a pair. It was the uh, the Mellow MBO1s um, in the Queen City colorway. These were actually a gift, but um, I actually do really love this pair. I Guys, I do not, I mean, some people actually have bad experience with this, you know, either it being the traction being trash or a lot of the times their soles are like bursting out and stuff like that, but I have had no problems with these whatsoever yet, and I'm in love with this pair. I actually I really want the I actually had a Rick and Morty pair but I actually ended up having like a size and a half bigger and I just had to sell them because it just could I couldn't fit them but um I got this pair but I really want the solar reds and I really want the Rick and Morty's but Jesus Christ the prices right now but um I got this pair so yeah the next pair on the list is the MBO ones but I've had no problems with these great shoe for the next shoe on the list I actually have um no explanation for this I actually just really like the shoe but um I've always wanted a Kobe because I had the Kobe fives I think my was my first Kobe that I actually ended up like buying with my own money and like because obviously the the first Kobe that I showed you guys my parents bought me those but uh this one actually the Kobe fives uh were so I started buying with my own money and stuff like that and then after that I kind of fell in love with Kobe so I started testing out and then my next pair was the Kobe six in the uh all-star colorway I got these bad boys right here these are just so beautiful I mean you guys they're red shoes Right, I kind of beat them up already, but I'm trying to preserve them as much as possible. But guys, I have no problems with these whatsoever. If you guys can get a pair on a pair of Kobe sixes, go do it, go do it, because these are just so great to play in. Oh my god! But um, yeah, that's the next shoe on the list is the Kobe fives. I know the Kobe sixes in the All Star colorway. And then not too far down the list, I went ahead and caught me some. Uh, these ones actually, when crazy story. So uh, I actually went to the outlets. And I was I was just there and I was just like, let me just walk inside the Nike store And so I went inside the Nike store and you guys know how like in some Nike outlet stores in the back They have the wall which normally has like clearance and stuff like that So I just went back there to go look at my size and crazy I mean if you guys want to go check it's on my TikTok. I had literally I literally have the receipt and everything I found these KD 15s guys these KD 15s Brand new in a box KD 15s for $89 because it was like 20% off for the entire store and then this was also on the back wall which was also on the clearance which was just absolutely crazy in my size it was just absolutely wild but yeah guys my next one on the list is the KD15 and I absolutely love these I don't know why but I just feel different in these I don't know why something about it just the feeling uh, I have you know some people saying the, the slippage and stuff like that on the back heel but I don't feel it whatsoever I don't know why but guys I love this shoe uh, KD15 on the next on the list. Boom. I had to get a pair of some uh, some Nikes that came out, and uh, I didn't know which pair to get until I saw this one come out. But you guys already understand why I got this colorway. It's not even a question of walk. But guys, I had to get the PG6s, and there's no other colorway you can really choose for besides the tie dye one. Uh, why not, right? I actually got these, and then. Uh, I love them. Love the lockdown feel on these. These are super light. I don't. These are, and then just the fact that they look like this is just absolutely crazy. Uh, Paul George, you're doing a great. But next one on the list is the PG sixes. All right, y'all. So for my next pair, this one was actually. I mean, you guys just. You guys already know my personality. I'm not even gonna keep saying it. But I had to get me a pair of these because I saw them on his feet, and I don't know why I just instantly fell in love. But I had to go get me a pair of tray of ice tray Youngs. I don't know what colorway this is, but I think this is what they're called. I think they're called the ice. Um, but I had to go get me one of these. These are just absolutely beautiful, you guys. I mean, I don't know why everybody... Some people saying that they're not messing with them. I don't know why. Some people saying that. What are you guys' opinions on these, personally? I think these look fire. I don't know why they're tripping, but they are... They are beautiful. I mean, look at the details. They got polar bears, and then the... Uh, we got boost. And then even it's boost, you guys. It is boost. That is the craziest part about it. It's boost. But um, I absolutely love this colorway. Nothing much to say. They're very comfortable. Uh, grip on them is immaculate. Uh, they're super light, like, great shoe. These are the next ones on the list, Trae Youngs. So 
So like I said, not too shortly after I got those sixes a while back, uh, the newest ones came out. I don't know what time, or I don't know how long ago it was, but um, the Mama C just came out. You know, R.I.P. to uh, both of them. May they both rest in peace. Uh, I ended up getting me a pair. Oh, that was my wrist. I ended up getting me a pair and I absolutely adore these. I actually really am preserving these as much as possible, but I love playing in them just because they feel great on my feet. They feel absolutely, you know, beautiful. And it's just, there's nothing much to say besides, you know, guys, get a hand, get, get, your, get yourself a pair of sixes. Get yourself a pair of sixes. Um, so, uh, now we're in like, this is the last few stretches. Um, the, like I said, you guys, I love pink shoes. So after I got those tray on, maybe a like a while after I started beating those up because those blue ones are done for, I actually ended up getting the pink ones. These are just, bro, look at the color trans, bro, look at the color transition from pink to, I don't even know, I think that's green, but, uh, bro, look at this. These are just so fire. Guys, come on now. I got ices on my shoes. Like, come on now. Absolutely gorgeous. Nothing much to say besides, I mean, guys, go get yourself a pair before they're gone. Uh, he's dropping absolutely heat, but uh, I'm not getting the twos because the twos look stupid. But um, nothing much to say about those. And then now we're on to the final pair. This pair has not been worn yet. This pair literally just released, um, you know, coming to the date from where you guys are watching it. But it literally just released and I have not played in them yet, but I'm going to play in them today. Um, the Aunt Pro KD15s. Nothing much to say because I haven't played in them yet, but I, I just, I'm too scared to because they just look absolutely gorgeous. They're, guys, I got suede on my shoe. Like, I don't even think that's, like, it's, it's fur. It's like, I don't even know what this is. It's like, look at this. It's like, I don't know. But guys, oh my goodness, these are so beautiful. Like, look how pink they are. But this is a heart. But yeah, guys, this is going to be the last shoe on my list. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, thank you guys so much for finishing the video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please leave a like. Let me know down in the comments with, uh, any suggestions on how you guys feel. Uh, without further ado, make sure you guys go look at that new brand. It's on the up and coming. I swear to God. Uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.